everybody, my name is Zul and welcome to a modding Fallout 3 video. Today I am going to be talking about a way to fix uh, some of the random crashes that uh, some people experience when they're in small interior areas. This is most likely due to the fact that they have multiple CPUs. Dual and quad core CPUs unfortunately don't work very well with Fallout 3. However, there is a fix for it. The first thing that I'm going to ask you to do is navigate along to your Fallout 3 any file. Uh, that can be found at uh, user, whatever your name is, documents, my games, Fallout 3. You'll get this fallout.ini. I am going to edit it with Notepad++. You can edit it with uh, Notepad as well, but I prefer to use this program as that is what it is designed for. I'm going to click here, I'm going to hit control F, and I am going to search for B use threaded AI. Alright, and we have it right here, it says B use threaded AI. Now mine says equal to one. This is what you want it to be. If it says zero, change it to one. There is another fix. I num HW threats. Now, for some people, this will be zero or uh, anything else. And if this line doesn't appear, add it in immediately after the AI one. Add it in exactly like this, and you want it to equal to two. This will restrict the number of cores that the game uses to two and fix the crashing. If you continue to have crashing in small interior areas, come back here and change this field to one to restrict the number of threads. There is also another method that some people have reported as working, which is to download uh, this D3D9DLL and insert it into your Steam folder right here. Uh, I personally do not need this fix for my game to operate properly, however some people with Intel hardware have reported this to be an admirable solution. So go ahead to the link down below, uh, I have one here I found on Mega, download it, uh, and then drop it in your Fallout 3 Steam folder, uh, Steam Apps Common Fallout 3 Game of the Year, right in here. Thank you very much for watching, uh, this has been just a quick little video to show a small fix for a crash, uh, it is going to be followed up by uh, a basic introductory series to modding Fallout 3, but I thought I would release this video first, just in case anybody was having problems getting the game started. As always, I would like some feedback in the comments below. Uh, I, you may also have noticed that I have a different quality audio, that is because I am now using a blue snowball microphone. I did a, well, a kind of crappy unboxing video, so if you want to check that out, uh, go over there, and uh, in a couple of days, maybe a week or so, I will release a review of this microphone and how I found it. Anyway, thank you very much, I've been Zul. I don't want to set the world on fire I just want to start a flame in your heart.